Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're ready for some rock and roll with your favorite cast. But who goes first? Summer. Hey. <laughs> okay, Summer Breeze Hathaway, played by Jade Pettyjohn. She started playing the tambourine to ultimately become the band manager. Yes, she's changed in the last four years and looks very beautiful now. Remember her crush on Freddy? Next you'll be mashing up your names the way celebrity couples do. That's Fremmer! <laughs> Too bad they're not that close in real life. Do you like Freddy in real life? Uh, no. What? What? <laughs> yeah, she has something else going on or someone else. Also a very talented girl. Can you read the poem? You know him! <laughs> She can really sing. And she's been acting since she was eight years old. Check out what I found. Her first role in The Mentalist. Cute. This year, you might have seen her in The Righteous Gemstones, Deadwood, and as a voice of Celeste in Middle School Moguls. Hi. And fun fact, you know that TV show is based on the 2003 film with Jack Black, right? Right. <laughs> So in the movie, the summer character is played by Nickelodeon legend Miranda Cosgrove. Yes, Tinkerbell. Summer. Now, Zach Kwan played by Lance Lim, the band's electric guitarist torn between strict parents and rock and roll. Well, I wouldn't recognize him here. He only changed a haircut, but he looks completely different. Rock star. Zach, Zach, Zach. Zach. More like a K-pop star, but still cool. So Lance is an actor and a musician, and he's doing some covers on his YouTube channel. Also with his best friend, Ricardo Hurtado, AKA Ferretti. That's cool that they are still so close. Right, Zach? Oh, uh, I wasn't listening. <laughs> As for acting, this year he guest appeared in many TV series like Fresh Off the Boat, Speechless, Splitting Up Together, and Pen 1-5. Sokoroboro. Oh, we don't, we don't speak Japanese. Me neither. Now, fun fact, he was raised in California, but he comes from a Korean background and is fluent in Korean. Also, he's an avid table tennis player. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not him in the photo, just saying. Next, Freddy Huerta, played by Ricardo Hurtado. The cool kid who loves skateboarding and having fun. Also known for his good hair. There's way more to me than just my hair. I've also got eyes you can get lost in. Yes, and eyes too. He looks older now for sure. Very handsome, no surprise there. If you wonder why he's so ripped, it's because he plays a lifeguard in a movie and a TV series, Malibu Rescue. So he's working out a lot to fit the role perfectly. <laughs> That's great news. It's like his main show now, but he was also in The Goldbergs. Uh -huh. And is the voice of Finn in Middle School Moguls. As you've seen, he also sings and even released a single this year. You can watch it on his YouTube channel. I'm so excited I can hug you. Now, fun fact. He booked School of Rock in the same week as he started auditioning as an actor. Not bad. Fortunately, I can fall back on my looks. <laughs> and one more, but you might have guessed this one. He has never dated Jade Pettyjohn. Never dated Summer? No, I never dated Jade. It's a shame. They were so great together. Maybe in the future. <laughs> or maybe they have a real life. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you, Summer. I hear you. Now, Lawrence Dooley, keyboardist for the band, tech savvy, but a bit dense and other stuff. Bring it in, sister. <laughs> yes, he's also changed, and he's super tall now. Lawrence is portrayed by Aiden Miner, who describes himself as an actor, gamer, and a Boy Scout. As you can see, he has a lot of badges, so he must be pretty advanced. Also, he has a channel on Twitch, so you might find him over there. As for acting, he didn't have any gigs since School of Rock, but I'm sure he'll find something soon. Meanwhile, check out his two siblings, brother Riley and sister Delaney. Awesome, and delete. <laughs> now briefly about his on-screen girlfriend Esmeralda, played by Haley Powell. She's an actor and a pretty good dancer. 
You can follow her performances on YouTube. Where's Tamika? <laughs> Next, we have Brianna Eady as Tamika, bass guitar player and lead singer. Also, Summer's best friend and little monster. I am a little monster, sorry. <laughs> wow, she was the smallest kid in the group, and now she's a gorgeous young woman. So, like these other guys, she's incredibly talented. She acts, sings, plays the ukulele, guitar, bass, piano, and drums. I have a gift. <laughs> she's also a songwriter. First song I ever wrote, I was 12. Very impressive. Now, I wonder if you've noticed her on the Malibu rescue poster next to Ricardo. Yes, they have a little reunion there. <laughs> I guess the series is doing well as they're making another movie called Malibu Rescue The Next Wave. That is so cool! It is. Also, she was the voice of Anne in The Loud House. I have to say, she has this unique, deep voice which I love. Oh no! It's a Yes, you've got me there. And if you were curious about her dating life. No boyfriend till I'm 25. That's what I'm on <laughs> Yeah, that's for the best. Now I get it. Now, fun fact, Brianna is the youngest of six children and she was born in Sydney, Australia. She has no accent though, because she grew up in the US. Hello! What? <laughs> Next, Breck Basinger is Kale the planet-saving sweetheart, and Freddy's love interest. Freddy! <laughs> I don't have to introduce Breck to Nick fans as she was the lead on Bella and the Bulldogs. Hmm, she hasn't changed that much, but she looks great for sure. She's a monster! <laughs> you might have seen her lately in Chicken Girls and the comedy show All Night. Also, Breck hit the big time with her new show, she will play the title role in DC Comics' Stargirl. The show should be released in a few months. I hope it's good. Sounds good. Fun fact, before becoming an actress, Breck was a competitive cheerleader. Now, Jama Williamson as Principal Rosalie Mullins. Well, she seems like a fun person in real life. Probably she's doing some redecorating. She appeared lately in two TV shows, The Good Place and Single Parents. Look at me now, Mom! <laughs> and these are her two daughters, Adeline Rose and Roma Hazel. Now, a bit about her right hand, Clark O'Shannon. DJ Igneous in the house. Ivan Mallon plays this wicked hall monitor. There are some differences in his looks, but he's still pretty small for his age. Permission to tase. No! <laughs> this year, Ivan played a bullied kid in one episode of the hit show, Young Sheldon and he appeared in a few episodes of the series Pen 1-5. Next, Dewey Finn, substitute teacher and wannabe rock superstar played by Tony Cavallaro. Here with his wife, actress Annie Cavallaro. You might remember her as Buffy Bonavita. I've sat on you many times. <laughs> Always nice to meet a fan. <laughs> According to the cast, he's super funny. Yeah, that's a surprise. So as you know, Tony's an actor and a real rocker. And what's fascinating? In 2018, he played the rock legend Ozzy Osbourne in the biography film of Motley Crue. No way, that's so cool. You know it. Besides that, he's a series regular on The Righteous Gemstones. I appreciate that, pound that out, my man. He even bumped into Jade Pettijohn in one episode. She doesn't know. She might not even know. Wait, what the f She's a grown up, all right. Now, fun fact, Tony graduated from the Virginia Military Institute where he learned to be a soldier. I'd never guess with his hair and character. Luckily for us, he prefers jamming. Okay guys, that's all from us. Say Weezer! Weezer! <laughs> Please like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.